Okay, it's been 11 days since the corn froze, um, and it's been coming along nicely. I'm out here in a different field now. I wanted to show you guys how the corn has been doing. Um, it's been coming along pretty well. We got some heat. We did get some rain. Um, and initially, when it started coming back, one of our big concerns was how uh, you can see these leaves, the old leaves here that are dead, are kind of tying up the new leaves. And at, at first that was a big concern, um, everybody was kind of watching that, but as the corn is, has gotten bigger, it started growing out of it, um, these will end up being the bottom leaves of the plant anyway, so as long as everything's coming behind it here on these new leaves, this isn't too big of a concern. Um, but what we're hoping is that uh, there's actually, or what I'm hoping is there's some thunderstorms coming maybe the next few days um, that will We'll uh, hit this with a hard pounding rain and a little bit of wind maybe and, and actually kind of just break them all open like that. Uh, most of them look pretty good. There's a few of them like this one here looks, it looks to me like it is stunted a little bit and that could be because of that. It may or may not be. Um, but I have seen some plants where I do believe that they are stunted because of that. Um, but for the most part, these fields are coming back really well. This corn has taken off in a hurry. Um, we've had a lot of heat in the last week. Uh, it's been in the 70s an awful lot, which is pretty good this time of the year for where we're at. Uh, so that's an update on where our corn is at. It's coming out of it pretty nicely. And uh, this last couple of days here, we've been spraying corn a lot. Um, we've been getting the spray down, getting the fields cleaned up. That'll kill off all these little weeds that are coming. Um, it's important to get these weeds taken care of as early as you can. Even when they're small like this, they are robbing yield from, from the corn. Um, it, it's no, no good for, for anything to have extra, extra plants in the field that you have to have competing against your corn. They steal nutrients and moisture and uh, everything the plants need in order to give you a good yield. Um, so we got going on that the last couple of days. We've covered a lot of acres spraying and it sounds like we've got some rain coming tonight and tomorrow maybe for a few days. So. We've been pushing pretty hard with the sprayer to try and get a lot of acres covered before that rain comes because that could keep us out of the field for a few days. Um, once that rain clears up, hopefully I'll get some video and, and show you guys what we're doing with the sprayer.